Okay, boys. Hello, hello. How are we doing? down the street, it's all women. See, there's another. <laughs> there's another one. Like there's an old one. Oh. <laughs> there's an old one. <laughs> oh. There's a war. Oh, there's a whole van full there. There are billboards. There are a bouncy, bouncy one over there. Yeah, bouncy there. <laughs> have to bet and see if the rain's going to come down on us or Slayer or none of the above or Anthrax or Metallica, you know, so. Sean Drover, our drummer, has a bet that it won't rain while we play, but somehow or another the big cloud of doom always seems to come over, but he's right, it usually doesn't rain, it just hovers there, and then when Slayer comes on, it rains, rain and blood, if you will. You guys want to see what really goes on in backstage life? Come here. Little project I've been working on. Some people work on songs, I work on pens. This is pathetic, but it's a big rock show. That's what you do. Loads of fun. This is my third, my third round because it keeps. I, my, I think my ass is getting bigger. Well, I, I ate those beans before and it keeps farting through it. That's what's happening. It looks great, right? A little Frankenstein action. Seems to be working. But this is life on the road. It just keeps getting better. <laughs> it's great times. Wine, liquor, sewing. Look at all these people. I feel like going through Satan's belly. What, this? Yeah. Yeah. Off a lot of dudes here. Look, no weapons, umbrellas, bottles, recording equipment. There's only one toilet here, which I'm worried about for later with those fucking beans. I mean, somebody's usually sneaking up the bathroom you can't get in there. That's what happens with these big shows. You have one bathroom that somebody clogs up one of the bowls, the other bowl everybody uses so there's a line. And if you got to take a big hot shit... Positions. That's a big problem. You know what? The home bowl advantage. I'll be home in a week, and that's cool. I need my home bowl. It's really hard with these bowls, but you don't trust them. You gotta line them with toilet paper, like a, like a big throne, until it's like really packed up. And that's the only time you can sit and hopefully not get crashed. That's what you really have to worry about. Well, there you go. That's life on the road, kids. Oh, there's coffee here. Look at this. Get this. It's like this. You tried it? What? You tried it? Um, no, somebody else did. They said it's this. Try it. Joe's the connoisseur. The coffee connoisseur. Okay. Yeah, well, that spoils it when you have shitty coffee and it just like sticks with you for the whole day. What is that? The air conditioner. 
Wow. Dude, they're only the best. Blows out the door. <laughs> For fuck's sake. Here we're going out to the big wide world of rock here. This is where it's all going to happen. It's a wonderful stadium here. Lars said this is just a killer place here, and he is right. It's awesome. Big kind of round stadium. Last night we were actually in the hotel watching the news, and they flipped over to this, and they're actually showing them building the stage. So a lot of people here, man. This place is, is very big. Very big, man, out in, the middle of, out in the middle of nowhere. I've never been to Bulgaria before. Seems like we had to go through Serbia. Well, see, we came out of Budapest, so we came out of Hungary, into Serbia, out of Serbia, into Bulgaria. So uh, a few passport stamps along the way, which is always good. And this is it. A whole lot of people, a whole lot of gear. Let's see what we got. Check some doors are open, so some people are starting to filter in. It's funny, you know, these things, no matter how big you get, it's all just a big battle of the bands at the end of the day, right? It's a bunch of gear, move one band off, put the next one on, move them off, put the next one on. So, uh, it's just like it was in high school, just a few years later. So, uh, let's see what we got. Cool view up of the hills and everything back there. We have to have something to look at, too, you know. I mean, we got the audience, of course, which are phenomenal. And then, I guess, later tonight, we're going to do the big jam with Metallica on the encore, Am I Evil? And uh, we've got ramps and things up above, so I guess we're trying to figure out where to put, like, all 17 of us on the stage, so it should be fun. Fortunately, it's a big stage, so it shouldn't be an issue. So anyway, there you have it. Welcome to Bulgaria, I guess, right? Rob's opening a noodle shop in the dressing room right there. It's called the noodle shop. Noodle shop. Noodle shop. This is getting close up with his mouth while he's playing. Guys, this pass is what we're using for the rest of the Sonic Spirit Festivals. This is the meal ticket that you all have. All the trappings of Rockstar are right here. So we don't really need to run over anything, do we? We should make a little nightmare. If we don't yeah. know it by now. Sorry. I'm just in a goofy mood, I'm sorry. Play Nightmare first then? Yeah. Why don't we uh, warm up on something slightly less manic? Okay then. Like, am I evil? Okay. Let's play the rip main riff in Am I Evil? Like I couldn't remember the intro to Am I Evil because of all the rock royalty in the room. No, no. Yeah, I went out there. Are you set up for Nightmare? Now? Did you did you want to do Nightmare now? Uh, I'd rather do something else. Just to warm up the arm on something. Fuel. <laughs> 